You're saying the night of the murder, that young man woke you up once, twice, a third time to go hide a murder weapon and clothes? Yes. You're saying that happened? Yes. Okay, but you didn't come forth. A child's life has been taken and you didn't come forth and tell anybody that someone had confessed that murder to you? Because I didn't think that he really did it. I mean, I didn't think he would actually kill a bo that boy. Well, when you found out the next day that there was a child that had been murdered, did you link the two up? Well, uh, I still didn't, I mean, I didn't know what to do. You do the right thing. You tell the truth. Novel, I understand, but you tell the truth. So here's what you say on the 13th. Then uh, you, you come along and you have a second and third story. Okay, now he's in jail and that's that phone call we just heard. So when you're first asked who killed Trey, you say you did. This is your second story. You say that Galker killed Trey. Why did you say that when you got the phone call? I didn't know what to say. I didn't want to be in this whole situation. That's why I didn't call the cops. That's, you know, I just wanted to be, you know, not involved. But in they this second phone call, in this phone call, <clears throat> you say to the detectives that Galker killed him. Now, you, you're saying he woke you up in the middle of the night with a murder weapon and clothes in a plastic bag, and you drive him to a dumpster to throw him away, but you don't tell anybody that. The next day you find out, wow, a child has lost their life. Then, then you get a call here and you say Galker did it. What, why did you say Galker instead of, of Young? You I say, I don't know what to say. Why offer him up? Why offer Galker up? I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to say. Had he told you to say it was him because he was going to cover up for him? Yes. So that's why you yes. said it. What do you mean you don't know what you, don't, you didn't know? You did it because he told you this is the story. Then he ambushed you on the phone. You didn't know which lie was current. Right. You didn't know. You tell him who really did it. You didn't know. Are we sticking with you taking the fall or are we going to tell the truth now? Right. You didn't know. So then Detective Russ says, okay, immunity. You're not going to get in trouble. When press, Cassie changes the story to little Josh killed Trey. He woke her up three times saying he killed Trey and she helped him take the bat and bloody clothes to a dumpster. You think the police might have wanted to know that the next morning? Yes, but you know, I would have been put in jail too and I have kids. You know, I didn't know, I didn't want to be involved in all this. I didn't think he would have killed that boy.